Today we're going to be unboxing, cooking, eating, and reviewing this Canadian military ration from 2017. This one is salmon. My name is Dan, and welcome to DC Outdoors. If this is your first time here, and you like outdoor adventure videos, gear reviews, military ration reviews, and other outdoor related stuff, we'll get started by clicking the subscribe and the bell notification button so you don't miss anything. Well, let's get on with our review. All right, well, let's take a look and see what we are having for lunch today. All right, we have a coffee crisp bar. We have the beef jerky. We have an orange sports drink. The old pain hamburger bun. We have another orange sports drink. A beverage bag. Peanut butter. Oh, interesting. Ocean Supreme Zesty Seafood Seasoning. Frank's Red Hot Hot Sauce. Raspberry Jam. We have sliced apples. The salmon. We have a Nescafe Sweet and Creamy. The old Book of Matches. The old compressed napkin. Paper napkin. Tic Tacs. And the spork. Here's a look at the beef jerky. We've seen this one in a few different um, of these individual meal packs and they always, it always seems to be fairly good. Turkey is definitely fairly dry. You get a good sized portion of it, which is good. Next, we're going to get this salmon cooking 220 calories.
get the orange drinks going. I don't know if we've had the orange drinks yet before, but again, each one is 60 calories per package. You can mix them really well in these drink bags. They look great. You can drink from them, but we prefer to throw them off into a cup. Creamy. Now these are about my absolute favorite things to enjoy out in the outdoors. I continue to believe that these are almost a breakfast in and of themselves. If you just have this alongside a oatmeal or something like that, you're usually set to go. They're very, very, very sweet, but they're very good. Got that mixed up. Oh, that looks good. Can't wait to have that. Next up, the sliced apples. 150 calories in there. There's the salmon. It's been heating up for Five minutes. Hard to tear this pouch. Ew. That's a lot of water in there. It's fairly gross. Might need to pour that out. Season to taste. So this is the seasoning that comes along with it. There's the English side. Chili pepper, salt, lime juice, silicone dioxide. I definitely think I'm going to put some of that on there. Looks nice. There's the coffee crisp bar. Slight little bit of blooming on it, but nothing major. Looks well, pretty good. I guess now we can get to sampling. Mmm. With the lime. The lime and the peppers in that salt are pretty good. Not bad, really. Not the worst thing I've ever eaten. So the salmon's not bad. I mean, overall, I think that this seasoning definitely saves it. We thought about putting the hot sauce on it, but I think that it's okay to just leave that on the side. I mean, it's really not that bad for old salmon. The jerky is always fairly dry, but it's pretty good. It's quite hard, but the jerky has a really good sweet and sugary flavor to it. And that's what the finished peanut butter and jam looks like. Not bad. The bun is a little bit dry as always, but the peanut butter and jams are good. Interesting that on these ones from 2017, they only came with one peanut butter, but it seems that the ones from 2018 were coming with two peanut butters, so that's kind of interesting. How are the apples? Mmm. Mm. And the apples are pretty good too. So far everything's pretty reasonable. This one looks like it came with 
good snacks. I like the jerky and the chocolate bar. There's the sweet and creamy. Absolutely delicious. Love these coffees. Mmm, that tastes a lot like the McDonald's orange drink. Very good. Mmm, nothing wrong with that. Well, overall, that Canadian individual meal pack wasn't too bad. I'm not a big salmon eater at all. Um, I avoid it, I don't like it, but overall I thought that this was okay. The salmon itself was um, not too fishy. It had relatively good texture. Um, I mean, it was soaked in that water, which I had to pour out and kind of clean out of the bowl, but um, the salt that it came with was really good and I think that that made it great. We ended up putting a little bit of the Frank's Red Hot Sauce on the salmon and uh, definitely was good. Um, the sliced apples are always awesome. Those are always a really big hit with us. Uh, we know what to expect when it comes to those hamburger buns. I mean, they were always quite dry and this was really, um, you know, followed the same that we expect. Um, in terms of the snacks though, uh, the jerky is always awesome to find in these and the chocolate bar was great too. So, um, overall, I think, you know, if I was to rate this one, I would probably rate it maybe a four to five stars. Um, reasonably pretty good. Um, relatively impressive. I thought the salmon would be much grosser than it was. Uh, I thought that the snacks that came with this one were pretty good. Um, so yeah, overall probably rate it four out of five stars. If you like outdoor adventure videos, gear reviews, military ration reviews, and other outdoor related stuff, we'll get started by clicking the subscribe and the bell notification button so you don't miss anything. Until next time, We'll see you outdoors.